Hey everybody, this is Kevin Deal with Romeo Music, uh, coming at you from San Antonio, Texas, from the uh, Henry B. Gonzalez Convention Center for the uh, Texas Bandmasters Association Conference. Uh, we're going to be looking at the Romeo Music booth today, and we're going to go over some new field systems. Marching season's upcoming, and we're going to be looking at some pearl mallet station devices that have come out and some accessories for that, as well as uh, just some new products that have hit the market uh, that would be good for your upcoming school year. So. Uh, Let's go check it out. I'm Julie Romeo with Romeo Music, and today I'm here to talk to you about getting you a customized sound system. Right before us, right here, we have a typical rack that we would put into your band orchestra or choir room. We can customize it with any type of mixer that would be appropriate um, for your performance and rehearsal needs. You'll also notice all the other components from CD recorders, USB players, USB recorders, even the drawers. So we also have speakers that we can go powered or unpowered, and we'd like to customize those to fit your needs as well and your budget. And we're happy to come out and do an assessment for you. So please think of Romeo Music when you are looking for your new sound system. So this is the Allen & Heath QU16. It's a compact digital mixer in the QU family. It's one of five products that Allen & Heath makes in that family. A lot of users and engineers really like this product uh, family from Allen & Heath because it's so easy to use. It's very intuitive for a digital mixer and the sound quality is excellent on it. So just looking at the console a little bit on some of the features it has, this is the QU16 as we mentioned and it's a 16 channel console so you can plug in 16 mic inputs to it. When you plug something into channel 1, it appears on channel 1 so you don't have to repatch the console constantly to try to figure it out. The other thing that makes it very easy to use is that there are only two layers to deal with. So we give you a fader for every input channel that you're going to have so you don't have to toggle between layers uh, which can be uh, somewhat disorienting for a, a novice sound engineer. Another feature that makes it very easy to use is when you want to do anything to a channel whether that's adjust the gain, uh, do something with parametric EQ, uh, even adjust a, a noise gate or a compressor. There's a dedicated knob and button for each of those features. Um, so instead of having to go to the touch screen to do everything, I can select the channel, for example. I can adjust the gain. I can adjust the frequency of one of the EQ sections and the gain, all with a dedicated knob. Uh, instead of necessarily, on some consoles, you would have to go in and touch a screen and make some changes there to get access to all the features. One of the features of the QU series is that we can put all of the mix outputs uh, on faders. We call that sends on faders. So right now I'm mixing the left-right mix, which is going to be my main mix. If I want to do something to adjust the monitor mix one, I just select mix one button and I have a separate mix now. If I need to adjust something in mix three, I can do that. Everything is independent and when I want to go back to my left-right mix, I still use that right there and uh, I'm back mixing in there. So it's a very fast and efficient way to, to mix monitors on the fly. Um, the board also has a built-in compressor and noise gate on each channel and four dedicated digital effects processors that can be assigned within the console. Now what about what about somebody who is afraid of consoles and wants to mix on their iPad? Do they have the option with this? Sure, so you can do remote mixing wirelessly through the QPad app, uh, which I'm showing right here, and you'll notice it's tracking the console perfectly, so whatever adjustments I want to make, uh, the app follows that. Another advantage of using this as well is it allows me to actually do more than one thing at a time. So maybe I'm working on the EQ section of uh, a particular instrument or vocalist, mm -hmm. and I'm doing adjustments there, but I want to be able to quickly grab something else. Um, I can have my app out and open and be doing other features there. For example, maybe I want to have my mixes open for my monitors. It almost becomes a second screen if you want to use it that way. Excellent. So 
our field system moving into the uh, marching season that we've decided on this year, we're using the QSC E series. Uh, we really love the, the QSC uh, E115 because it has a very robust high frequency compression driver. It starts at 2.8 and ends up at 1.5 inches. A lot of high frequency information can get out there at high volumes. Uh, one of the things that you'll notice with a cheaper or lesser uh, design is that when you start cranking those volumes up, you really start hearing those high frequencies bite down, uh, high mids and highs bite down, which is undesirable. Uh, and with the high demand applications of, of uh, marching band and the high SPLs needed to get to those stands and the amount of projection needed to have the sound travel that far, we really, really decided that we wanted to get a robust speaker to, to handle the, the job. All right, well, Kevin's already explained why Romeo Music chose the QSC E-Series loudspeakers uh, for their premium marching band field systems. Uh, you know, they have high quality drivers in them and really um, high continuous power handling ratings so they can project a lot of sound, especially in a marching band environment. Another advantage of using these QSC E-Series loudspeakers is that we're recommending them with either the QSC PLD series of amplifiers or the GXD series of amplifiers. These are digital uh, power amplifiers with DSP in them and they are optimized to enhance the performance of the E-Series loudspeakers because QSC has measured these speakers in many different aspects and come up with a set of models or presets for these speakers, which we call intrinsic correction. They use various filters and parametric EQ and limiting functions to provide the optimal performance of these speakers. And those are included as presets in the amplifiers, so they already come loaded for your system depending on whichever speaker you're using from Romeo Music, so your system is optimized out of box. You pretty much just have to hook up a mixer to it and uh, give it some signals and, and start rocking the stadium. with Romeo Music. I'm here with the Mallet Station today. Uh, just want to show you a couple cool features that it's got. Uh, of course, it's MIDI controller. It can have any sound. Uh, right now, I've got it hooked up to be a marimba. One of the great features of this is that you're not stuck to just a three octave instrument of any given notes. I can change uh, the range from any diatonic note on the keyboard. So even though it defaults to an FDAF instrument, with a couple presses of the button and just moving these gap caps around, I can switch this to a C to C instrument. Uh, so now all of a sudden I have the range of a full five octave marimba down to the low C if I need to. In designing this device, uh, Pearl obviously thought about a lot of extended techniques and uh, traditional uh, means of playing an instrument. So you'll hear I'm gonna play a vibraphone. One of the beautiful things about this instrument is that I can actually mallet dampen just as I would on an acoustic vibraphone. I've also got all of these uh, assignable parameters here set so that if I want, I can turn on a tremolo, make it sound like I've got the fans on, and then I can adjust the speed of the fans right here on these assignable uh, faders. 
another great feature about the mallet station is uh, in the included editor, I can enable all of these in-between patches to be sounds in themselves. So even though I've got my keyboard set up to sound like a timpani and a set of chimes, all of these in-between notes are my accessory percussion devices. So I can be an entire percussion section all by myself. Of course, it can be any percussion instrument that you want. I don't, uh, I don't necessarily need to play uh, pitch percussion. One of the great things about this instrument is it, it's really been designed well to avoid double triggering on any of uh, on, on any of the pads but it's also sensitive enough that I can play really fast strokes and it'll pick up every one of the notes without cross-triggering, without double-triggering. As you notice, I'm playing it with my drumsticks. Uh, you can play it with any, uh, any mallet or, or uh, implement. Uh, it's been designed so that it, can, that it feels just as good with a yarn mallet or a timpani mallet or a drumstick. Regardless of what you use, it's going to sound good, it's going to feel good under your hands. Of course, you're not just limited to percussion instruments. Uh, you can play, it's, it's a class compliant device, you can play any sound through it. That, that's just to show you a harp patch, I can play an upright bass or a piano or a synth lead if I want to. So it will pair with any device. You can plug it into your iPhone, it'll work with GarageBand. You can plug it into an Android device, you can plug it into a Windows machine. It'll work with anything out there. Uh, super easy device, uh, works with everything out on the, on the market. Uh, these retail at $9.99. Uh, we've got them available on our web store through your local Romeo representative. Uh, if you're interested in the Malice Station or if you have any questions about how to use them in your classroom or anywhere else, uh, feel free to contact me. Again, my name is Ryan Uningst. Uh, my email address is ryan at romeomusic.net and I'm happy to answer any questions you might have. Hi, this is Felix with Highway Marketing and I'm here to show you the new MB88 Plus by Sure. And we all have a high quality camera in our pockets. Whether you have an iPhone or an Android, you have a really, really good camera. What you don't have is a really good microphone. And if you're a musician or if you care about recording sound, um, you want good quality. And that's what you have with the MB88 Plus. Everything you see here except for my phone comes outside of the box, even with a carrying case. So you get a tripod, that doubles as a handheld, and you get a clamp for your phone, and you get a stereo microphone. There's a free app called the Motive Video, and it allows you to um, record video with high quality audio. And the microphone, since it is stereo, you can adjust the, the, the width of the microphone, you can adjust the pattern. So if you don't want to do stereo, you don't do stereo, you do mono. And Everything plugs into your phone, again, Android and iPhone, and best thing, you can monitor what you're listening to. It's right there. Again, this is the MV88 Plus by Sure. Hey, thanks for checking out our video. If you like what you saw, please click on the subscribe button below. That way Romeo Music can send you a new clinical video or product review or anytime we send a trade show or release a video of that, you automatically get a notification and you can just click on the link and check it out. So thanks for joining us and we'll see you soon. Take care.